Arsenal fan TV, what do you make of it today? Yeah, Rob, I think a uh, comprehensive victory in the end. I mm. mean, um, I've come to this place and it's been a bit shaky, but first 20 minutes, we was rapid. I mean, Theo was just out of the park. And going back to what Mo said, Francis Coquelin's distribution, his tackling, to a T is perfect. Mm. And I just feel like there's too much stick for Giroud. Like me and my boy were just chatting. We bought him for 12 million quid. And now if you buy a strike for, for 12 million quid and last season he got, what, 14 league goals and he was three months out, I think Gunners need to get excuse me, behind him. Mm. I just feel like we gave him too much stick. Obviously, we didn't sign anyone. And he does look like that sort of player that where it will affect him as well. And, and that's why I was so glad that he scored after missing that very yeah. easy chance. I was so glad that he scored because he does seem Definitely. the type of player yeah. where he does you know, feel what the crowd and feel exactly. how the crowd are. I mean, we forget they are human just like me and you. And mm. I mean, I feel like Giroud is reflective of Arsenal. When our backs are against the wall, he performs like he should, like the striker that we signed in him. And I just feel like we just really have to support him. And, and I mean, again, going back to what that boy just said, Ramsey in the middle, I'm one of Aaron Ramsey's biggest fans, but I feel like he has to come into the middle and Ox for me has to start. Mm. And, uh, Could it have been that maybe with Ox today, maybe, I mean, he has played two straight games yeah. for England. You know, maybe maybe they felt, you know, give him a little rest before bringing him in on the end I mean, if you're, if, you're, if you're in emotion and the form's going, I feel like you should keep that continued. Mm. I mean, like Giroud, he just got booed when he was with his national squad. And I mm. feel like he's come in, he's done really good for Arsenal. And I feel like we should start him against Chelsea because Chelsea are more of a physical squad. Mm. And then when they get tired, bring on Theo, stretch the team out, mm. bring on Ox. And not forgetting we got that game during the week against yeah. um, Dynamo Zagreb. So who yeah. for you starts in that game as well? Again, Dynamo Zagreb, probably a tough team. And I mean, they're going to come here wanting a win to mm. prove a point. Uh, but we're over there. Are we over there? Yeah, Sorry yeah. about that. Yeah, away. Mm. So I feel like, yeah, Giroud again. Because, mm. again, he's physical. He has a presence about him. I know he's not your Benzema's or your Iguain's or your Cavani's, mm. but we've got to stick by him at the end of the day. Who, for you, would you start with? Well, before today, it was own goal. <laughs> 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 it's a fantastic signing. I haven't even seen him. <laughs> um, Theo, I think. Because then Giroud comes on and he feels a bit aggrieved, so hopefully he'll get a bit get stuck mm. in. 